Hello, Daisy. Hello, Daisy. Hello, beautiful girl. Uh oh. Hello, beautiful girl. Should we get your nappy changed? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So I was just feeding this little gorgeous one and she just did a really special trick. Projectile vomited all over. Ugh. Great. Hello. Hello beautiful. Mmm. Mummy better get that cleaned up, hadn't I? Hey, does mummy need to clean that up? Yeah, yeah. Oh, thanks, Daisy. <coughs> thanks, Daisy. Thank you. I need to get dressed, but I'm kind of stuck. Hello, Jaden. Yes, I am. No matter how cute you are, baby, mummy needs to get dressed. Yeah, but you're not going to want to hold her the whole time I'm getting dressed, are you? Uh-oh. Do you know what she's up? Hi. You haven't seen me in a while. <laughs> Do you know what she's done to me already, Charlotte? Been sick on you. She projectile vomited all over the back of the chair. Oh, Mrs. Oh. This is Daisy's favourite thing to do, is snuggle with Mummy. This is why I think without Paul now, with him being at work, I'm going to find it very hard to get things done. And I tell you what, she is trumping like mad on my hand. <laughs> well, it's probably about half past nine and I'm still not dressed. So today's going pretty well. <laughs> I haven't done anything. Oh, you are just beautiful. So I finally managed to get dressed, semi do my hair and uh, managed to get the little one back off to sleep and now she's just woken up again. So while she's still a little bit content in a Moses basket, I'm gonna start doing my makeup. So, uh, this from Primark is a godsend for these dark circles under my eyes at the minute. They're so puffy. I don't know what to try to get the puffiness away, like the big bags. If anybody's got any tips or anything, please let me know because they just look dreadful. So, yep, I am just gonna do my makeup and no doubt little missus, so I'm just going to do my makeup, but no doubt little missus will stop me at some point. Oh. 
Oh. Hello, baby girl. Is that light a bit bright for you? Because she's had such a long sleep last night. She had a really good night's sleep. She went to bed uh, about nine and she slept all the way through until just gone three. Had your bottle and a big, big poo. So had your nappy changed. And then went back to sleep about four o'clock and then didn't wake up until half past eight-ish. Something like that. So you had a really good night's sleep, didn't you? Yeah. So now that she's had a bottle, usually she'd have a nap at this time, but obviously she's saying, no way, mama. No way, mama. I just want cuddles. Yeah, but mummy needs to do her makeup. Oh, piggy. Oh, little piggy. Oh, dear. Oh, hey, how are Burpees. So I managed to finish off doing my hair, finish off doing my makeup, and now I'm just about to get little Mrs. dressed because she didn't stay asleep. Did you, baby girl? I think she must be ready for another bottle. Yes, you are. Yeah, so let's get this off. I tell everybody you absolutely hate getting dressed, don't you? Anybody would think mummy was murdering you when you get dressed? Oh, of course we just hate it so much. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Shh, shh, shh. There you go, get the back in. Get the dummy in. Good girl. Hello Daisy, hello my gorgeous girl, hello, oh he's a beautiful girl, she says come on mummy just get me dressed because I'm going to start crying in a minute, I get so fed up of you doing stuff like this, hello, he's oh, a beautiful girl, yes you are, Yes, you are a beautiful girl. Yes, you are. Oh. Yes. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> There's one beautiful girl all done. Yes, it is. Oh, oh, oh. Come, come, come. Right, now mummy better go make your bottle, aren't I? So everybody's been fed and watered now, apart from uh, the little madam. Um, apart from, I was sick earlier. I was giving, well, um, Charlotte was having a bath and uh, all of a sudden I just had to barge in and say, sorry Charlotte, but I need to be sick. Um, I felt fine before that. I don't know what happened. I just started to feel a little bit dizzy and then felt it all come up, but it was just like really watery. God knows, don't know why. Um, I feel fine now, I've had some dinner. I think maybe that was just it. Um, I had taken some cocodamol though this morning without anything to eat, so maybe that's what it was. So, so I'm gonna feed this little cherub. Where are you? In a little swinging chair. She's been asleep for quite a while now. Yeah, so I'm going to feed this little madam and then I think we're going to go out for a walk. The boys are only just getting dressed and I haven't got a clue what time it is, but I know it's past dinner time. So, uh, it's very, very windy outside. I am, uh, I'm just having a look through the window now and it's so windy. The leaves are like blowing around like a tornado, I like that bit.
so I'm a bit windswept now. It is so windy out there, it's proper blowing a gale. Um, went all the way to the shops and they didn't have what we went for. I wanted some bright water for Daisy but neither the chemist or the co-op sold it so I have to wait until we go out tomorrow. So um, I'm going to sign off for a little bit, get some cleaning up and everything done because it's about half past two and I've barely done anything. Um, yeah, so the next time you see me will probably be on the way to a swimming group. So I'll catch up with you in a bit. Hello baby girl, hello baby girl, hello, hello precious, hello precious, <laughs> did you wake mommy up at four o'clock, did you wake mommy up at four o'clock? Yeah, thank you. So today is Monday. Um, I can't even remember what day it was the last time I filmed. Uh, yesterday we went just out shopping. Um, yesterday we just went out shopping. I needed to go to Boots because I was dying for some new stuff for my eyebrows. Um, in. We needed to get some extra food bits. We had our food delivery come last night as well. Um, Saturday we actually went up to Birmingham to visit some of Paul's family um, who hadn't seen Daisy yet. Uh, Friday... I can't even remember what happened on Friday. So... Little missus woke me up at one o'clock this morning, had a bottle, went back to sleep, and then woke me up at ten to four. So, seeing as though I get up at ten to five and she's only just finished a bottle now, and it's twenty to five, <laughs> there's no point in going back to sleep again. So, yeah. So, like I say, it's Monday, the kids go back to school today after being off for half term for a week. JD starts his new school today. <laughs> She's just trumping away in her Moses basket at the minute. Right. I'm hopefully going to sit and enjoy my cup of tea while she's semi happy in her Moses basket. So I am going to vlog today. I'll vlog as much as I can. Um, it's going to be interesting just being me and her. So yeah, oh, look at the stay. Mm, it's this is definitely a shock to the system because Charlotte, who was was my other youngest, is nine now. So it's been nine years since I've had to do all this. I'm definitely struggling more in my thirties than I was in my twenties to do it. <laughs> oh my god! Right. Hopefully the next time you see me I'll look a bit more presentable and not as haggard and tired. Bye. I've also just realised as well it was Thursday the last time I vlogged. And it was group night, Slimming World group. Um, I lost two pounds. I was a little bit gutted about only losing two pounds with it being my first proper week back on plan. I kind of was hoping for three or four pounds but... Um, I suppose my consultant was right. It's not as if I need to... Oh dear. Oh dear. It's not as if I need to lose a huge amount, which is probably why I haven't lost as much as I usually do. Um, two pounds is two pounds and it's better off than on. So. Okay, so it's ten past one and I'm finally back home. I was not planning on being back home this late, but... Oh. 
it was my first time doing the school run with four kids and as you can imagine it was pretty manic and it was absolutely peeing it down outside. Um, Yep, so after I dropped Billy and Charlotte off, I had to go and drop JD off at his new school because his taxi, his transport's not ready yet. Um, then I went and did a little bit of shopping. I wanted another snowsuit for Daisy, but guess what? It is February and there was no snowsuits. Everything was spring clothes. Um, have you seen the weather outside? Is it not freezing still? Is it not? peeing it down with rain and there's just like these really thin tiny raincoats no snowsuits and it's still freezing and it's probably going to be freezing until may i just think it's absolutely ridiculous when shops do that yep went shopping got her another uh uh oh god baby brain what's it called sleeping bag got her another sleeping bag because we've only got one and she tends to be sick on it a lot so it's in and out of the washer and I needed a spare. Um, I'll show you a bit in a minute, it's very very nice from Matalan. And then I popped to see my dad, had a drink with him. We got back home about 20 past 12 and I've just had some dinner. Absolutely scoffed it down because I was starving. And Mrs is still fast asleep in her car seat so I've just made a cuppa, another, um, and I'm just researching about blog posts at the minute. Um, I've got a sink full of pots to wash, loads of pots to put away, I've got loads of jobs that need doing but while she's asleep I don't really want to make noise and wake her up so it's a perfect excuse to have a cuppa and look on my phone. And also, can we just take a moment to appreciate my new jumper that I'm wearing. I got the the other week from Primark. Do not judge me, it's cheat day. <laughs> I just think it's hilarious, I love it, it's cheesy. I like me a bit of a cheesy sweatshirt. I think it was five pounds. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I did do that right, didn't I? <laughs> but yeah, I like it. It's really nice just to chuck on for the school run. And then I've also got um, some girlfriend jeans on from Next. So I might show you a little outfit of the day. Well, you can kind of see, there's no point, is there? I mean, if I jump up, <laughs> then you can see my jeans. And uh, jeans. Um, Leopard print trainers from Next. Can't remember when I got them, but quite a long time ago. So they probably won't have them in it. Well, no, they won't have them in anymore. They may have something similar. Yeah, I do like a cheesy sweatshirt and a bit of leopard print, apparently. So I said that I'd got Daisy a uh, sleeping bag from Matalan today. And this is it. So pretty. It's got elephants on it. Let's see. Elephants. Elephants on balloons. Oh, I just thought it was really cute. Yeah, and that was £12. And that's obviously not six months. But we were told not to put her in this straight away. Um, not from newborn anyway, but she's a month old now, so I'm assuming that she's allowed to go in them. Well, I'm putting her in them anyway because it gets really cold on a night and she just kicks all the blankets off and everything so this is really nice and it's not too thick so this should hopefully see her through like spring on a night time as well. But the only thing she needs to learn to stop doing is like last night she got up at one and then got me up at four but that's not what she's usually been like she's usually got up at um like half past two so i'll change a nappy then and then sometimes she slipped in till say seven um but between those hours at some point she's having the biggest poos in the world and then she must be having a wee afterwards so then you can imagine the wee's got nothing to soak into 
and it's just coming straight through a bodysuit and a sleep suit and onto these. So every morning she wakes up and she's absolutely soaking. So I'm not really quite sure what I can do about that unless I set my alarm and change a nappy. But then how is she supposed to learn then to sleep all the way through the night? I don't know. Hmm, that's one, that's food for thought, that one is. Right, so I'm gonna go and do some housework now um, because I can hear little misses starting to make some cooing noises. Those cooing noises will soon turn into cries. <laughs> 